Target practice, baby. Hey, what's up, Charter fam? Uh, I just wanted to take a look at some meme coins on Deck Screener really quick. I just kind of see what has been hot lately. Because Deck Screener, like I said, I've been kind of pulling back off meme coins. But we're looking right here at the six hour chart right here. Let's see, Pepe the Chad. Um, let's see what's going on here. I like how they got it in black and white. Looks pretty good. Looks like it's already been running see me first off example I see this is what I would do this right here boom so I will leave that there 79k liquidity it looks like it's locked 551k on the FDV on the FDV um, fully diluted the uh, volume is about 3.5 mil that's pretty good uh, 24 hour on the 24 hours about 890 per 897 percent that's pretty good um, with the one hour, the five minute, it looks like it's kind of dropping a little bit. Let's go ahead and let's see. The token dropped about six hours ago. I'm going to grab the actual token address and we're going to go to rug check and see if we can find out just a little bit more uh, information on the token. Good risk analysis, 100% LP locked. Radium has about 7%, nothing too interesting in the wallet. Um, you know, there's a lot of, let's see, yeah, okay, here we go. Um, do, 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 do. Like I said, it dropped about six hours ago, so that's pretty good. Um, this token looks all right. Let's check out the actual website. Make sure you guys check out the Twitter page, the Telegram, all that good stuff. You know, you guys want to make sure you guys do as much uh, research on these tokens that you can before purchasing bags, okay? Um, I like how they put everything in black and white. Um, the website is kind of mid, you know, tight. Looks like we're on a downtrend now. It actually ran almost to a mil, 961K. Now it's starting to pull back. It's at about almost 600K. Um, that looks pretty good. Looks like it's on a um, it's on a slow way down. So let's see. Four hundred and fifteen subscribers. Um, you know it's mid. Let's go ahead and just slap it on the watch list. You never really know. I wonder when Pepe is gonna get old like it played, bro. You know like pepe is cool okay the one that's on like coinbase or whatever wherever the hell it said it said um it's on like crypto.com and things like that that pepe okay is certified you know what i mean now i wonder when everybody's gonna stop making these pepe remakes you know pepe memes and crap look right here it's looking like it's kind of it's trying to break it jumped all the way up to about 600k that's pretty good so we're gonna see if it's gonna uh you know toss out our little resistance line but i think it's gonna bank off and start working its way back down looks like the buyers are getting smaller and smaller down there but um you never really know you kind of have to just keep your eyes on it but let's go back and um let's see let's see if we can go back all right pepe the chad okay the name is kind of trash didn't like it let's see 13.2 mil the smiling dolphin this one's been out about three days. Uh, volume about 24 mil. About 4% in the last five minutes. Let's see, 24 hour volume, about 154%. The Smiling Dolphin. Minaru. Liquidity about 547K. Oh, look how it started out. When it first came, it was just rolling. It was just pretty much a stumbling block. It looked like it released about October the 7th, somewhere around there. And then it looks like it just kind of rumbled, rumbled around for a couple days, kind of ranged. And next thing you know, as of about, if I can get this correct, probably about um, October the 9th. Okay, there we go. Let's go ahead and, okay. 
let's go ahead and try that one more time. Bro, I see what's going on. I need to uh, move. My computer is garping right now. But you know, you kind of figure, I'm wondering, like, why is something moving? But I'm clicking, it's going the other way. Okay, whatever. But um, anyway, so as of, like, the 9th of October, um, it pretty much ran to about, let's see. Yeah, it went up a bunch, bro, because it doesn't look that big of a run, but it's a run. It's a serious run. So it was a serious run, then it pulled back. Hold on. Sorry, you guys, my computer is working against me right now, okay? So it dropped down about 73%. So it looks like it probably ran up about 90%, something like that. And then it dropped back down about 73%. And then once it ran 73%, about October the 10th, the next day, this Saharu or whatever, it just ran like crazy. I can't see nothing on my screen. It was all jack. It ran about a, a 6X. I mean, it moved. It went all the way from about the 2 mil mark to almost 20 mil. So it did a 6X. That's crazy. Minaru. That's something to look into. That's a that's a lovely chart. When you see it, that's, that's a lovely chart. You can see there's like a small sell-off now. There's still some buys coming in. Let's see what the website is looking like. Oh, look. Doom, 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 doom. Finish him. That's what we're not going to do. Okay, so that, it is a uh, pump fun token. So, that's something that, oh, you know, like, I mean, it's cool. Pump fun tokens can run, like this one. You obviously see it ran about 20 mil. If you bought in down here and you were able to hold you bought in down here and you were able to hold through all that madness you made some good dollars you made some good dollars so if you go here look at that that's that's crazy right there you did something like in a range of you know maybe like a 20x something like that over you know you put 10 bucks in or some crap come out with about a thousand or two you know but looking pretty good. This one's good though. Um, Smiling Dolphin. This one might be something to look into. But me, you know, of course, I will just slap it on my watch list and kind of see what's going to happen right there. It's looking pretty good. But to me, it looks like it's going to start pulling back. But considering what the chart's looking like already, it might be something to look into once it starts to pull back some. Right now, it's at about 13 mil. And you can kind of see it's kind of slowly going up. But then again, if you look down here in the order book, you can kind of see there's a lot of sell orders coming in. So I'm imagining that if I do this, something like this, put the magical resistance line up, I can almost guarantee you that it's going to come down. Look at that. It's almost 4500 almost and a $2,000 that pulled back. So it's probably going to pull back, but it's something to look into considering how this chart is looking um, if it does once it does decide to pull back once it kind of uh, corrects itself it might be something to look into at that point because it has a good chance of taking back off some more um let's see next one we're gonna look at uh, we're gonna look at cringe Okay, we're gonna smallen that chart up just like that. Cringe. Okay, I think that's kind of horrible. I didn't even look at nothing yet. I just, yeah, okay. Let's see what that's about. It's trash. Let's 
garbage. Um, I don't like the meme, so I'm not even going to look into it. But you can see, look at this. If these numbers, bro, look at that. Almost 17,000% 24 and 24 hours. I mean, you can obviously see that it's coming down. But damn. You know, people better not say anything about meme coins not doing numbers, bro. They do their numbers. It might be a little irritating. I know it's hard for a lot of people to think like... <coughs> You can just create something real quick, start putting money in, and your money just increase. A magic money machine, you know, put it in the USDC and transfer it in your bank account. Boom. But, you know, it's, it's, it's legit, bro. It's legit. So, look at this. I like this chart already. Chart looks pretty good. It's a spin wrap on Seoul. Uh, 47K liquidity. 324K on the fully diluted. 2.7 mil on the volume. 24 hours about almost 24,000 percent. That's pretty good. This little spin rat. Let's just click on the website really quick because this is just crazy. I mean, enter. Oh, we're definitely gonna click that off because I didn't know I was gonna start playing that music and YouTube be tripping, bro, about that. So we're gonna leave that off. Um, I'm gonna have to watch that though off camera because that looks a little interesting and trash at the same time um, It's looking pretty good, you know, like I said, I like the way the chart looks on this one, too I just I just like healthy charts. That's all you know I don't I mean I'm not too sure. Let's go ahead and hold on Let me scrap you know, remember, this is just me looking around at different meme coins, you guys. You guys do your own research on this. Don't buy none of the stuff that I'm checking out here today. You know, you guys go on these websites, Deck Screener, you know, um, uh, Photon, you know, all that. And uh, just kind of, you know, look around and kind of pick some good meme coins. Just do your research on them. Check websites, telegrams, things like that. You know, all that good stuff, Twitter pages and stuff. And find out as much information as you can about the team. Check comments, all that stuff. Telegram is really uh, useful for that. Good risk analysis on the spinning rat. 97.62% uh, of the LP is locked. Uh, Radium has about 7%. Uh, someone has about almost 4%. It's nothing really too interesting on this rug check. That's really spiking my interest. But, um, you know, that's just kind of how that's looking. So just kind of have to go and open all the doors and, you know, kind of, you know, look through and kind of see what you can see. Uh, make sure you guys do your research before you guys start buying bags of these tokens, okay? Just take a look at a couple of these. Um, Hawk Toshi, Spin Rat, Wet. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and just rock off the video for now. And uh, you guys, let me know what you guys think. Uh, you guys, are you guys into any of these memes? Have you guys checked out any of these new meme coins? I think I'm gonna go ahead and go into the search and I'm gonna find some fresh ones, like fresh off the boat uh, memes and uh, go ahead and present them. But I don't. You know, we don't know whether they're going to pop or not. You know, nothing like that. I'm going to just find some fresh ones off deck screener. As long as the risk analysis is coming, the, trade, the risk analysis is coming back good. And you can, um, the trading is open on the tokens. You guys can get money on these. The problem is, is that the world of memes, everything just moves fast. So when the memes come out, everybody starts buying in. Boom, 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 boom. That chart is running, 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 running. Next thing you know, when it gets to a certain point and a couple of people sell, everybody else gets scared and they all start selling too. Next thing you know, you get the big red candles and they're going down to the ground and everybody's running away to a different project because they think that everybody's rug and blah, 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 blah. But really, it's just people are selling and people are going on to the next project, all right? You guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Like the video, subscribe to the channel.